Glad you could join us for what looks like to be a perfect day of golf on the garbage adjacent greens of Turnpike Valley. So sit back, wipe the seagull crap off your shoulder, and breathe in the fresh Jersey air. <coughs> There's nothing like the taste of sulfur hexafluoride in the morning. Straight out of the impoverished confines of Rodeo Drive, this gated community gangster puts the rap in crap. After his debut album, Me Rap Good, sold only one copy, Ice Tray hung up his turntable and dusted off his clubs for a shot at golfing glory. Caddying for everyone's favorite trust fund thug is Ice Tray's partner in rhyme, Fresh Fruit. Harvest is a true free spirit who believes in free love, free speech, and the freedom to beat the crap out of anyone who disagrees with her. When she's not burning her bra or braiding her armpit hair, Harvest can be found smacking the Mother Earth out of recycled golf balls. Hole in her bag is Tree Hugger, her granola munching, tie-dyed, sexually repressed caddy. Better hide the stash. Born and raised in New York City, this Columbia University PhD is a triple threat, brains and boobs. When she's not in the science lab or getting dollars tucked into her G-string, Summer's hobbies include public indecency, one night stands, and of course, golf. Carrying Summer's clubs today is her pole dancing sidekick and hot body double, Autumn. Yippee, the ninth! Okay, this is your typical Garden State variety 410 yard par 4. Built under two interstate highway overpasses. <coughs> yes, I'm allergic to exhaust fumes, so I really hate this hole. I'm also allergic to dust mites, pet dander, and penalis spores. So keep your damn penalis away from me, okay? Our first golfer is Ice Tray. You got to be kidding me. That ball was smoking. Seriously, did anyone see those flames? If you have low self esteem, this should help. Ting off second is Harvest. Sweet. Maybe good golf isn't so hard after all. Walking softly, carrying a big club, is... Summer. Even through this vodka haze, I can tell that was a nice shot. Second shot. That shot will not get it done, unless the goal was to hit it like crap. All right, second shot. Grab your sunscreen, we're heading to the beach. Second shot. Nice contact on that one. I think I'm about to cry. No, it's just gas. Start manning the suicide hotlines. We've got a live one. Summer is going to need a shovel to dig this one out of the sand. Here we go, third shot. Anything is still possible. Third shot. You know, the law of averages says this could be a good one. But then again, it could suck. That's the thing with averages. What do I know? What am I, a, a math teacher? According to my high school math teacher, who I still hang out with because he buys me beer, this hole is mathematically over. Forget 12-step groups, you're doing just fine on your own. 
Looky here, ladies. I'm a robot. Pretty good, huh? Your scrap metal. Sticks and stones, bitch. Anybody got an ibuprofen? Here we are at the eighth. Ay caramba! This 213 yard par three is muy short. I have nothing against shortness, but as a man of great stature, I find myself constantly looking down on short people. Sometimes I see the tops of their heads, but mostly I am gazing at cleavage. Ah, it is good to be tall. Nice contact on that one. Someone's headed in the wrong direction. And I don't mean a trip to Jersey. Harvest. Looks eager to whack one off. Looks like somebody's taking golf lessons, and they're not working. What an ugly landing for an otherwise attractive ball. Sad. Second shot. Second shot. Now that was all touch. Second shot. I can't say enough about that shot, nor do I want to. What a harsh break to the right. I would hate to take a sobriety test here. One word, nice punt. Okay, so I failed math. Let that be a lesson to you kids. Stay in school. Ice tray is tapping to shoot for a glorious par. Can you tell I want this hole to end? Look out! Harvest is hoping to drop this one in for par. Now that's a nice putt, golf fans. Can't get any closer than that. Looks like we have a push on this hole. Give it up for the seven. Friggin' crap. This hole's 476 yards. Thank God it's a par five, because the fairway's longer than a bunch of football fields. Not that all football fields are bad. After all, I lost my virginity on one with Tony DiPaolo. Yep, right on the 50-yard line. My only regret is I wish it happened after the game. Tony always did have a problem performing in front of a crowd. Nice! That ball just got some prime real estate. Summer is armed and itching to fire one off.
Nice! Give that ball a gold star. If I was any more excited about that shot, I'd need a tissue and an apology. Nice! That was good for both of us. Okay, second shot. Too early to panic. No one should complain about that shot. That's my job. Second shot. Whoa! Anyone got a chainsaw? Like a deacon at a Boy Scout convention. Talk about an uncomfortable lie. Second shot. Time to pat somebody on the back. And while you're at it, I'll take a hot old body rub. Third shot. I know one golfer who should stay away from lottery tickets. Third shot. As if by actual skill and not complete accident, that ball is on the green. Third shot. Nice shot! If you have low self-esteem, this should help. Fourth shot. What's not to like about that shot? If only you could take it home and dim the lights, put on some Barry White. Oh yeah. Summer is putting down a gentle slope to drop a paw in the bottom of the cup. Nice putt, and that's all that matters. Harvest has this putt for a shot at birdie. School must be in session because that was some textbook buddy. Ice tray is attempting for a birdie. No pressure. Hit it already! Okay, looks like we're gonna be pushing on this hole. Forget 12-step groups, you're doing just fine on your own. Check out the sixth. This here be a 350-yard par four. I ain't never seen a building that big before. The biggest structure I was ever laid my eyes on was when Stucky Gibb built a two-decker outhouse onto his mom's mobile home. If you ever get the privilege to unleash your bowels in there, I recommend using the second floor. Way 
to go! Give hop hooray! Ho! Speaking of hoes, that rash didn't clear up, did it? That'll be good for your game. That shot makes me want to become a better person. Second shot. That'll score a 9.6 with the German judge. Second shot. Well, that sure makes club selection easy. Second shot. on that Prozac refill. For a birdie, or execution by firing squad. <laughs> How's that for motivation? Houston, I think we have a golfer. Summer. Has an opportunity for a shot at birdie. Nice stroke, nice putt, nice job. Ah, yes, there's nothing like a tie to settle absolutely nothing. Lots of trees and a nice pond and everything. But then it gets kind of gross with big, ugly buildings and factories and stuff. Oh gosh, I hope Daddy doesn't own those, because if he does, then I think they're really, really nice. Did I mention it's a 490-yard par 5? Because it is. Nothing wrong with that shot. That's a good looking ball. I'm strangely attracted to it. on the horn. That ball is going ballistic. Yay! What a drive. I believe we've broken a record. Second shot. Concentrate. Somebody send over the cocktail waitress. I want to start celebrating immediately. Okay, second shot. Too early to panic. What's wrong with this picture? Oh yeah, that shot. <laughs> second shot.
Nice contact on that one. Oh my, that ball should be tried for treason. Take it away. Third shot. Ooh, who ordered the lousy shot with a side of crap? Third shot. Fourth shot. That ball is really moving. Is there a urologist in the house? I guess they work with fast-moving balls. I don't, who writes this? Oh, my! Third shot. Nice contact on that one. I think I'm about to cry. No, it's just gas. Nice! That was good for both of us. Are you feeling it, Trey? Yeah, man, I am feeling it. Hey, what are we feeling again? I don't know. You're the one who said, are you feeling it? I only said it because I thought you knew. Knew what? Hell, I don't know. Harvest is eyeing this pot to make a birdie. Watch out! I'm afraid this hole is mathematically over. Now, if it was up to me, we'd keep playing and playing, but then again, I'm a masochist. Amigos. I must confess, this hole is 356 yards. However, if you have the cojones to finish it in four strokes, you will achieve par. Now excuse me while I familiarize myself with an unfamiliar woman. Ice tray is about to launch it off the tee in 10, 9, 8. Nice! If you have low self-esteem, this should help. up a lot more in France besides a moped license and a nasty rash. Second shot. Second shot. That shot was uglier than a one-eyed redhead. All right, second shot. Nice! That was good for both of us. 
third shot. Nothing wrong with that shot. For a shot at birdie and all its glory. School must be in session because that was some textbook putting. How does the saying go? So close, but yet so what? It didn't go in, jackass. You can add it up any way you like, but in the end, we're done here, folks. We're here at the third. This is a 201-yard, par 3, complete with an oil refinery, waste management buildings in the distance, and the lingering stench of raw sewage. I love Jersey so much. I hope to retire here one day. Amazing what a little dumb luck will do for your shot. Yo, Fruit, what the F you doing? I'm the lyrical genius, not you. Here, knock yourself out. Uh, uh, I see, I see, both I see, banana fan and full face. Nice work, sir, sucks a lot. Good shot. Hope you enjoyed it, because you just got voted out of the zone. Damn, that was a stinky shot. Someone get a match. Second shot. What a nice light touch. Oh. Here's how it's gonna go down. I'm gonna continue to rip up the course, and you're gonna say, damn, Trey's ripping up the course, and I can't do nothing about it. I'm gonna say that's right, so step off unless you find and put out. Second shot, concentrate. Harvest is about to put up swollen earth to sink a birdie. Wow, what an inspiring display of utter crappiness. Amazing. By my calculations, this hole is mathematically over. Yep, it's the second. This one here looks to be 350 yards and a par four. Little more than midway through, there's a good old bend, like my cousin Harlan's injured back. But hey, that's what that pea brain gets for trying to milk a bull. That there bull milk is sticky. Nice shot.
Nice. Give that ball a gold star. That shot makes me want to become a better person. Second shot. Nice! That ball is seeing more green than the inside of P. Diddy's wallet. Or whatever he calls himself. Second shot. I can't say enough about that shot, nor do I want to. Second shot. Hung pow! Man, can I go for some Chinese food. for a tasty birdie. What a crap shot! Who's got some paper? Cause that was a crap shot! Summer has this putt to sink a birdie. Nicely done. Everyone who wants to see me naked, raise your hands. Just your hands, boys. Ice Tray is attempting for a shot at birdie and all its glory. Now that's what I call a stroke of genius. <laughs> Get it? Looks like we've got a tie on this hole. Say hello to a new record-setting putt. Don't expect it to respond. It's pretty conceited. My game is fresh. I'm gonna get laid. Bumping some ass in Escalade. I. No one saw that, right? Nope. Just all of us watching. I. Cool. Here we are at the first. This hall is 371 yards of Jersey's finest, which is not even close to the high standards I'm used to. First off, it's open to the public. <laughs> I mean, what is that all about? And what's with those overpasses and power lines? Ew, they can call it a par four, but it's subpar to me. What a shot! Oh my god, I'm overreacting! Summer is ready to spank it. Nice! Somebody send over the cocktail waitress! I want to start celebrating immediately! No one should complain about that shot! That's my job! Second shot! That is one caffeinated golf ball. Yeah. 
Second shot. Well, so much for being in the zone. That shot left skid marks. Second shot. That was piss poor. And how much poor can you get than piss? Third shot. Third shot. That was softer than my grandma's ass. Don't ask me how I know. Summer is putting up a bit of a hill. How's that for an in-depth analysis? For a birdie or execution by firing squad. <laughs> How's that for motivation? One word, nice putt. Okay, so I failed math. Let that be a lesson to you kids. Stay in school. Mathematically, this hole has reached its expiration date. I play golf like I'm in a porno. I hit them hard, score with ease, and keep the fans begging for more. This game has officially come to an end. By the way, the winner is... Ice Train! You did it, dog! Congratulations! Time to roll the credits on this game, because it's over. By the way, what the hell's a lead modeler?